up and welcome back to behind the TV, the back of our TV. Welcome back to the back of our TV because we are behind the TV. Well, we're not behind the TV. <laughs> you get me, right? Okay, anyway, we had another photo walk. Because we had another photo walk, we decided we were going to have another photo challenge. So this is our second photo challenge. This time around, we decided to have two categories. The first category was a negative space photo. A negative space photo is where the subject of your photo is not filling the frame. Instead, there's a whole lot of space and then the subject of the photo is somewhere in the photo. That's negative space. And then the second one was motion. The tricky part about the motion photo was we went through to a museum of transport. However, at this museum of transport, none of the cars or any transportation vehicle were moving. They were all still. So we had to somehow bring motion into a picture where motion was not there. This is the photo walk challenge, round two. <laughs> what happens when you throw your toys around? <laughs> I struggle with symmetry, so I am a very symmetrical person. When I was going through my pictures, I was trying to find a negative space photo, hoping I had taken one, but uh, finding that my photos were very symmetrical, so they were very even, you know, there was no negative space. But then I came across this special masterpiece here. If you calculate the inches, you can clearly determine that this is the negative space. And this is the positive space. So I'm very proud of this photo. This is a photo of a lady trying to press a button, but she's battling because her nail is longer. Sorry, isn't that a switch? It's a very bad design switch. <laughs> That's not a button. She was trying to turn the switch. Mm -hmm. Did I say button? Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, I meant switch. Poor lady. This is the negative space, and this is the positive space. So this is a ticket for people who would catch the tram long time ago in Johannesburg, South Africa. If you don't know what a tram is, this is what a tram is. It was in a showcase table and there were a whole lot of different tickets around it, but I wanted to just try and get one ticket and I really liked the, the texture and the color of the fabric that was on the table itself. So that is why I chose to take this negative space photo. The negative space is here and the very interesting part is over here which is actually in the shadow but you can't help your eye keep drawing to there because there's nothing here. That's why it's called negative space. So this is my negative space but yet there's a texture there. But yet it's negative. And you can't help but look over here which is the rest of it. So with this pictures right, honestly and factually, intellectually, I think this one in particular. Um, what switch is that? Is that a load shedding switch? <laughs> is it a... Maybe that's what it is. <laughs> yeah, you wonder which area it is, you know. This is where you switch off be... the lights. This one. Sasha's photo. Tower's picture. Tower's one. I think it's Sasha's one. Sasha's one. I'm gonna go with Ryan's one. This one. <laughs> of a 
wheel moving even though all the wheels there were still. So what I did was every time I took a photo, I'd spin my hand around and out of like a whole lot of weird photos, this one was my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, I was doing a cartwheel and I caught this picture while doing a cartwheel. Do we have that on camera? Do we have proof that no. we did a cartwheel? No, we don't, we don't. For those people who want to see what car it was, even though you can see clearly, this is the picture of the car that was taken. Cartwheel, car, cartwheel, car, cartwheel, car, cartwheel, car. <laughs> As Jesus said, don't look at the speck in your brother's eye. When you have a log. This is actually my motion picture because it's quite anti motion. So this wheel ain't going nowhere. You see, they really nailed it down the wood texture and then on top of that just looking at how they had to stop this thing from moving they had to nail it down so i had a lot of pictures to choose from but this one caught my attention because this part for me just that part that's where this part was when i did the motion thing it looked like a lot as a person who likes history, I was just fascinated about the cars and these cars were just so classic, nice. I think Ryan's picture. I'll go for Ryan's picture. Sasha's picture. He said his one. He said his one. He said his picture! This one. Yeah. Stop, stop. There. There. Go, Congrats to Sash for taking the negative space category and Ryan for taking the motion category. Two very good photos, it cannot be repeated. I don't think they, I think it was luck. 100% luck. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. <laughs> Comment, like, subscribe, and yeah.